हेलो माई सेल्फ सतीश थलंगे असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियरिंग वॉलचन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी सोलापुर इन टूडे सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू सी रिगार्डिंग द डिसीजन मेकिंग अंडर अनसर्टनटी एट द एंड ऑफ द सेशन द स्टूडेंट विल बी और द लर्नर विल बी एबल टू आइडेंटिफाई द अल्टरनेटिव अवेलेबल बाय कलेक्टिंग द ओवरऑल इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड सेलेक्ट द बेस्ट अल्टरनेटिव ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ द वेरियस प्रिंसिपल्स एंड द क्राइटेरियाज Now coming to the point, what is the decision making under uncertainty? Particularly, if the person or the decision maker don't know what exactly the outcome is going to be there, that is the certainty that of the particular state of nature, then the particular human is said to be making a decision under the uncertainty. And the commonly used criteria or the principles for the decision making un under uncertainty are as follow. the vital criteria laplace criteria hurghis criteria and the savage principle or it's also known as the minimax regret approach in the earlier sessions we have seen uh, regarding the vadas criteria a laplace criteria as well as uh, you can say now continuing to that today we are going to say regarding the hurghis criteria and the savage principle or the minimax regret approach now coming to the particular pay of table what is a pay of table it's a particular table which is known as the profit table also now the pay of as i said it is very pay of table is very helpful for making a decisions by using various principles or you can say the criterias now in today's session we are going to see one of the example and we are going to make a decision or you can say select the alternative by using the hurghis criteria and the savage principle you are the person mr krishna is having a particular plot and he is interested to have the decision regarding the making or you can say constructing the luxurious or deluxe or ordinary rooms and he can provide the facility of the lodging and next he can lease the particular land for the parking or any traditional fair or any function or the third option is that no plan at all so by observing all these options now we have to make a decision but for supporting to that presently he is paying 25000 a tax per year now this is a table which is representing you the various alternatives and the state of nature means it's there may be the high demand or normal demand or low demand and these are the outcomes or you can say the payoffs for the respective alternative for the respective state of nature with the help of this table and using the various principles or you can say criteria we are going to make a decision now coming to the hurghis criteria it's a principle based on the decision maker view may fall somewhere between the extreme pessimism or the particular extreme optimism in the present example the alpha they are defining that 0.6 and of course 1 minus alpha will be 0.4 as these are the alternatives lodging facility rent out space and no plan to find out the particular solution by using hurghis criteria the first step is what to identify the maximum value from each alternative this is a column which is representing the maximum value from each respective column so lodging facility the maximum benefit it we are getting for the high demand that is 5 lakh this is a maximum value which we have written here same for the rent out space the maximum value is 3 lakh which we have mentioned here and the for the no plan it's a minus 0.25 similarly we have to find out the minimum pay off is minus 0.5 for the rent out the minimum pay off is minus 0.30 and for the no plan it's a minus 0.25 now expected pay off 
is equal to maximum multiply by alpha plus minimum multiply by 1 minus alpha by using this formula we are going to get the payoff or expected payoff for each alternatives so here the maximum is 5 multiply by 0 0.6 plus point minus 0 0.5 multiply by 0.4 we are getting value 2.8 Similarly, for the rent out space as well as non plan, no plan, the values we are getting 1.68 and minus 0.25. Out of these two, we are going to select the maximum payoff. It's 2.8, which is the alternative related to the lodging facility. So, lodging facility will be best option according to the Hurgis criteria. Now, one more criteria that is a savage principle. The savage principle is nothing else. It's also called as a regret criteria or you can say minimax principle. Here, yeah, this is a principle in which the particular decision maker convert the profit table into the loss table or you can say regret table. How to convert the particular table from profit to the regret table? Let's see. The regret table is obtained by following method. You have to select the maximum or the best from the state of nature column. Here the high demand, normal demand and the low demand are the three state of nature. Out of this, the maximum, when we see this table, the maximum outcome is 5 for the first state of nature that is high demand, for the normal demand it's 1 and for the low demand it's a particular minus 0.5 difference between each respective alternative with the help of the best outcome from the respective state of nature so 5 minus 5 it's a 0 and 5 minus particular 3 it's a 2 and 5 minus minus 0.25 is 5.5 5. Similarly for the normal demand we can get the uh, regret outcomes or you can say lo uh, loss payoffs of the particular uh, alternative with respect to the state of nature. Here as I said the one is a maximum best outcome from the second state of nature that is normal demand. So 1 minus 1 it is a 0. 1 minus 0.5 it's 0.5 and 1 minus minus 0.25 it's a 1.25 similarly for the last low demand same methodology we have to use and we are getting value as 0 minus 0.25 on minus 0.25 now coming to the next step after getting the loss table okay this is a regret table earlier we have mentioned the profit or you can say the profit table now we are converted into the regret table or you can say loss table these are the values or you can say outcomes of the loss for each alternative for respective state of nature now we have to carry the step that is a mini max principle means what we have to select the maximum regret from each respective alternative for the first alternative the maximum regret is zero for the second rent out space the maximum particular regret is two and for the no plan the maximum regret is 5.25 out of that this is the values 0 2 and 5.25 are the maximum regret means these are the maximum loss for respective alternatives for the lodging it's a zero loss for the rent out space it's a two lakh loss and for the no plan it's a 5.25 lakh so by getting the maximum regrets we have to we are interested to select when we when i ask you from this maximum loss that is 0 2 and 5.2 which alternative you are going to select we are going to select the minimum value which is having minimum loss that is a zero which is related to the lodging facility similarly now we are getting lodging facility will be the best option according to the savage principle also in this way by Hurgis criteria also we are getting the lodging facility as i declared here 
and similarly by the savage principles also we are getting the lodging facility let's select the correct answer for the questions hope so you have selected these represented correct answers these are the references for the today's session thank you